Bro, why are we laughing at gnomes, bro? Welcome to the ACW podcast. Yeah, what a weird start. We're talking about meal plans. That's what I'm saying. You should at least eat something in the middle. It would lunch. Maybe like an egg. Boiled egg. A single Y'all gotta like explain what we're talking about. Okay, right. so I need to go on a calorie deficit because I got tits bigger than half the girls at my school. Uh huh. Really makes me insecure. And I also got turned down by this hot chick on one of the final days of school. That hurt. So, uh. Man, him, my it gave me class. gym confidence though. I'm gonna. I'm doing everything to the letters. I spelled out what she said. And it's 10 letters total. And all my. Everything that I do is gonna be 10 reps. Nice. Just so I can remember that. That's actually kind of smart. So, I was planning on meal prepping because I need to go on a calorie deficit in order to lose weight. Uh huh. But it sounds like I would be starving myself. I got it. Eat rice. Just normal white rice. Rice has so much carbs in it, bro. White rice has carbs in it? Yes. You did shit. It's just water and rice. Rice is made out of carbs. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Bro. High, I can't eat high carbs. I can't eat pasta. I can't eat. I can't eat like anything that's noodle based. Bro, I would so be down to eat chicken and veggies every day. Dude, I'd be cool with it. It's just I would. I would want to change it up. That sounds horrible. Trust me. Don't How do does that. that sound horrible? You'll get tired of the exact same thing. Chicken is so that's fucking why, good. What I would do with the smoothies is I would just buy new fruit every week. True. So I can right. keep it. Yeah. I can keep but, it different. And like you're saying, yeah, maybe I should eat something in the middle. You need to eat lunch at least. That's Cause, like a horrible plan. Well, if you no, because like the, if it would be one big smoothie, the smoothie would last the entire day. Or what about this? If you eat like an egg for like uh, brunch and stuff, not I, lunch. I would have, one egg? I would have to start the morning off making the smoothie. Yes. Meal prepping it in the cups, putting it in the fridge to save it. And then I would drink one before I have to evenly balance them out, calorie count them. Yeah. I would have to plan it to where I have to drink one before my workout, after my workout, eat something small, drink another one, eat it, and then eat one with dinner. And that would give me a total of like 40 grams of protein because I do two scoops. Interesting. But okay. Are you a picky eater? Depends on what we're talking about. All right, what would you not eat? I'm kind of picky. Tomatoes. I hate mm. tomatoes. Okay, what if I agree. it has like tomato in it, but like no like. If it's mixed with stuff, that's if it's like if it's like spaghetti sauce, that's good. Like, like tomato juice. No, like if tomatoes. Tomato juice, oh no. If tomatoes are like mixed with stuff, I would eat it. I I would. It like would tomato be... rice. What the fuck is tomato rice? It's Mexican rice. It's basically what we make. And yeah, tomatoes to white rice. We're going. Tomato. We're going shopping. I'll give you some later. We're going shopping this weekend, and I gotta explain to my mother what I want to do. And peanut she... butter, peanut butter's for gaining weight. Fuck, you're right. Damn it. It's it's, it's it, you usually add a scoop of uh, peanut butter. Fuck, or I hate the coaches that matter. Fuck. All right. That's why, dude. That's exactly why I left athletics. All they wanted me to do was gain more weight. I hate it. Because they wanted you to be an offensive lineman. I know. I'm a great offensive lineman. I don't <laughs> want to gain more weight. <laughs> I told my coach straight up, "Hey, coach, I want I I want to lose weight." He was like, "No, you're gaining weight. Fuck off." Yeah, what? <laughs> they, our school cares way too much about football. But we really do. We like, suck ass anyway. Aren't y'all state champs? Yes, we are. Not this year, actually. We sucked ass this year. And no, another part of my problem is not just meal prepping. It's it's working out itself. All right, what about this? Scare so long with charred green, green beans. Ew. What the fuck did you just <laughs> Charred? Or scare salami with charred green beans. Salami? <laughs> Where did you get salami from? Is that salami? Is that? I swear to God. Or is that salmon? Salmon. What is that? Salami. Wow, you are really stupid, bro. <laughs> is that <laughs> actually yeah. stupid? It says salmon. I, I'm sorry. There's wow, hold on, hold on. There's Show a, me this. There's Show- a- L in it. Show me. So, no. Shut up. Shut show up, me. Shut up. Shut up. Okay. It literally says uh, sealed salmon. How about this? Wait, wait. I just had a great idea. I just All right, had... here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Before you read it, All right. I have a great idea. Okay. Oh, this actually looks really good. Okay, hurry up. Come what on. if I make a smoothie that's worth three serving sizes? 
from one for my one for the beginning of the morning, one for the middle of the day, one with my dinner. And obviously, I'd have to eat something in the middle. What if I just got one of those like high protein, low calorie yeah. TV dinners? What about this? What? What are you showing him? <laughs> this salmon. This is the thing. That's fucking salmon, dude. Yeah. I, I can't. I can't. I can't make food. My mom won't let me. Even though I want to be a chef when I grow up, she won't let me touch anything in the kitchen. Can I make some five ice? No. Yeah, so, because, like, we used, we still get these, like, we get these, like, TV dinners that have, like, a lot of protein in them. It's, like, it's, like, 20 grams, 24 grams for, like, 270 calories. So that's, like, really good. But I would have to tell my mom she needs to buy five a week. <laughs> Or I can skip like a day, so I can do Monday. I eat one. Tuesday, Wednesday, don't eat one. Thursday, eat one. Friday, don't eat one. There's roasted cauliflower tacos. That sounds weird. It doesn't look too bad. Oh hell yeah, that looks amazing. It looks like chicken tacos. Let me read it. That has like radish in it, doesn't it? I'm not even thinking about like meal planning. I'm thinking about going on like a full on like type of diet. Chili, but I wouldn't know what type of diet. To me, I just know that I shouldn't eat as much as I do. Like, yeah, that's what I realized. Because, like I said, when I get home, I'd eat like a bowl of fried rice, a sandwich, and then candy, and then I'd go to sleep. Ooh. This is absolutely beautiful. So when I fall asleep, just all those calories are in me, and then I just sleep, and then it gains the weight. So I... The, another hard part is I don't have a car. I don't have a ride. I can't get to the gym. I tell you about the time that I almost got robbed outside my gym. Are you serious? What? Yeah, I had to run, and I was my legs were really sore. Uh, what I did because I didn't. It was like late at night, and my mom was like, "I'm close by." I was like, "Well, I'm gonna walk around the mall to the front because I work. I go to the one at the mall." So I walked around, and as I was walking, all of the sidewalks lit up and stuff. Besides this one corner, okay, and that corner I have to walk towards. Right? So I'm turning right and I reach the dark corner. There's some like, I couldn't tell if he was homeless or drunk or one of the <laughs> other, or on crack maybe. And he went up to me and was like, hey, do you get some change? And I was like, no, nah, man, I'm sorry. I, I don't got my wallet on me. He was like, well, you got in that bag because I have my gym bag on me. Yeah. I was like, bro, I'm just a kid. I don't want any like troubles, bro. He was like, just don't cause any and give me your bag. I was like, fuck. So I had, it was either, it was a fight or flight situation. But I didn't know if that guy had any weapons. I don't know what he could have had on him. Right? And he was like some skinny old white dude with like blondish hair. Like I could have easily taken him. But like, again, he could have had a knife, could have had a broken bottle, could have had a fucking gun. We live in Texas. True. <laughs> so. Get that out of the view. I'm not cutting that. So, so to put it in perspective, we're facing each other like right here, right? Yeah. The sidewalk is to here. The path that I came is behind me. I just bolted past him. And I knew, like, judging by his age, like, I'm a big boy. But, like, if I have to run for my life, I can run for my life. And I ran to the front. And once I got into the light, he didn't come. Because I guess he didn't want anyone seeing him or something. Because it was like it was like six or seven, like the mall was still open, so there's still kind of people walking around. But like the area that I was in is where the Macy's was at, but the Macy's is closed, so it was kind of it's that like boarded up section where all the oh. stuff is at. So that's why I assumed that he was homeless. And then I made it to the front, and my mom was waiting at the front. I was like, "Mom, I'm just gonna walk." <laughs> and she was like, "What?" And I was like, "There's a creepy old white dude in the corner over there. I don't know. He almost robbed me." And she was like, "Do I have to call the cops right now?" And I was like. That's a lot of paperwork. That's a lot of paperwork. <laughs> That's a lot of paperwork, Mom. I'm sore. I want to go home. She ended up calling the cops, and then they had to review footage and stuff. He never got caught. But So there's a crazy homeless person running around Texas right now in our city. Yeah, I just I just wait in the front of my gym now because there's so many people walking in, and now I know if I just stand out there, I'm fine. So. Yeah. And all of them are fucking ripped, so... Exactly. Just stand in the front. I don't know why I told my mom to park at the Barnes & Nobles. I don't know why either. Oh wait, I remember why. Cause in the in the mall, there's that exit that goes into the mall, and the Barnes and Nobles is right across. So I was just gonna use that door, but it was locked. Oh. So I had to walk around, and that's why. Uh, see, I, I I've been thinking to myself for the past like three weeks. I was like, why?
did I walk outside? <laughs> no, that's why the door was locked. That makes a lot more sense. Why did I do that? Man, I was stupid. <laughs> yeah, that was that was pretty dumb. All right, I got some little snacks you can eat. Apples. Apples, okay. That has a lot of natural sugars. What the fuck is this? Asparagus. Asparagus. <laughs> you don't know what the fuck is I don't, I couldn't read it. Beets? Bro, I love asparagus. Ew, though. beets are disgusting, bro. They Broccoli. are. Broccoli. Broccoli's fine. If you steam it, it gets rid of, rid of a lot of the shit. Yeah, I'm steaming it's okay. Uh, cabbage? No, cabbage not cabbage. Shit. Yeah. Carrots. I don't like carrots, to be honest. Have you eaten steamed carrots? I do not like carrots. I, I don't know why. Carrots. Cauliflower. Cauliflower is decent. It's different. I like broccoli more. I'm a personal broccoli. Yeah. I can agree. Celery. Celery is all right. It's weird. It's just crunchy water. It is. It, it doesn't have a taste to it. It's just crunchy water. Oh, it tastes so fine, though. so bad. Uh, cucumbers. Those are pretty cucumbers good. Cucumbers taste like melon. They taste like a, they taste like a fruit more cucumbers than a vegetable, are fine. in my opinion. I... I honestly, like, I know that they don't have, like, the characteristics of, like, a fruit. They don't. But, like, they taste like a fruit. Like, like, <laughs> they if, do. have you ever, like, tried one? It's like, is this a melon or a cucumber? It's, like, weird. I, I, I just thought about that. I was thinking about that when I was eating it on my sub sandwich one day. Yeah. I was like, why, why does it taste like there's fruit in my sub? Garlic. Just whole garlic. Just straight garlic? Gains. <laughs> what is that? Oh, garlic. I'll get gains, but my breath will smell like dog shit. <laughs> hey, no vampires on your ass. Grapefruit. Ew. I've never had a grapefruit. Is it really that bad? It's so bad. Grapefruit is that bad. It just depends bad. on who you ask. Some people like the unique taste. Personally, I do not. Grapefruit isn't that bad. There's lemons. a lot of things that I would eat over grapefruit. And eating just straight lemons sound horrible. I eat lemons. Why not? They're so good. Like, Bro, I so would like I would grab like a slice of lemon and put it in my mouth to eat it just to wake myself up. That's what I do. Bro, we have lemons no, at dude, my work and does, I just eat that when I'm tired. It does stuff to my teeth, bro. It makes them like really sensitive and I can't eat stuff after that. It's What's weird. next? Okay. I'm retarded. Watch this one. Lettuce? Is that, no, just, are you retarded? It's not lettuce. Let me see. I thought I said lettuce. A lettuce. Right under lemon, right? Yes. That said lettuce. Oh. Lettuce? Lettuce, Reyes. L E T T U C E. <laughs> yeah, that says lettuce. 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 What about lettuce? I make side salads all the time. With, yes. Uh, just like. Uh, Ooh, you should have chicken. Goodness. I had fat free cheese, uh, carrots, lettuce, and then. Uh, Italian dressing, reduced fat ones because it has less calories. I've heard if you eat chilies, it makes you burn fat too. It literally just burns. Oh, fat. and then it would burn me. <laughs> uh, mangoes. Mangoes are really good. Mangoes are good. I like mangoes. Yeah, I, ate, I remember I ate a mango with a peel on it. Oh, yeah, you did eat the It mangoes. tasted kind of good, dude. I think you're supposed to eat the peel. I think so too, but I don't know. I don't remember. Like, it didn't have a bad taste to it. It was like a skin of an apple. Or a chewy no, okay, never mind. Onions. Onions are good. Eating just raw onion. Am I am I Shrek? Like am I just eating Shrek? Just grab an onion and eat it like an apple. Spinach! You can be like Popeye. Bro, honestly, spinach goes hard. Spinach is amazing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask my mom to buy like spinach so I can put it in my uh Protein shake. Bro, not gonna lie, when I make pizza at home, I put spinach on it. Really? Yeah, I, I do. You're one of those. Pizza. You'd fit well in California. You really would, you nasty fuck. Anyways, Excuse me? Turnips. Ew. No. Who just eats straight turnips? I've never had a turnip. I don't, I don't wanna. I don't zucchini. want a Zucchini. I, I like zucchinis. Zucchini? The fuck are zucchinis? It's like a cucumber, but it's different. Yeah, it's like a cucumber, but not sweet. Yeah. And that's the last them. Okay, that's a good list. So, <laughs> what would you eat? Because you need to at least eat like two of these. Asper right, well, I go for uh, asparagus and zucchini. Fun fact: I'm, I'm, apples and broccoli. I'm allergic to most fruits. Are you fucking serious? Bananas make my throat swell up. Well, good thing bananas. Oh yeah, I remember that one. Like, I don't know why you didn't tell us that shit. Yeah, we went. Yeah. We went to we we went to Smoothie King this one day, and this fucker told us he was allergic to bananas as he was slurping up an angel food. Oh yeah, I'm allergic to bananas. <laughs> yeah, they they. It depends on how much bananas I eat. If I eat like two to three. That my throat closes up. I don't know how much bananas they put in that movie. I think it was but like two. It kind of just made my eyes puffy. 
Oh shit, that's not good still. Yeah, like when we're when we're when we're watching the movie, my eyes were like felt puffy. Oh. And it was kinda hard for me to see. Uh, my bad. Our bad. No, that's not good. It's, it was my choice. I should have read what was in it. I was at a smoothie. Thing. Yeah, this dude didn't even read it. He said, I'm getting what you're getting. He uh, had no I, idea what he was, was getting. Smooth- and you want to know why I want to go to Smoothie King? Why? I asked you if we could go tomorrow because I saw on their menu that they have this thing that, like, boosts your metabolism. I want to see if that was fact or cat. I want to, actually, yeah, I kind of want to say that too. I'm fat. Let me see that. And, like, especially since I'd be going to the gym more. Like, I could go. These guys with- always want me to pay for I never said you I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I just want 50 bucks, what do you mean? Oh yeah, true, 50, 50 This video is probably gonna come after that manhunt, the two hunters. Probably. Yeah, that's, that's insane. What are y'all thoughts on it? Oh, that show was amazing. It was fun, I just wish that Reyes didn't get I am sorry, did you not want those snacks? I would have done it for 25. I would have done it for yeah. I would have done it for twenty five. Yeah, he would have done it for half the price. I would have done it for free. I didn't know if Joseph would be good with bargaining or not. Just, I, it would just depend if it, I would hear your first offer, I'd be like, Hi. He offered me ten dollars at first. Yeah, I'd be like, And then you said twenty and I was re- I was like, Okay, deal and then you're like, No 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 and then he said fifty, I was I was like, I'll fucking do it, bro. Like, cause I I, I would think about it and like if you said twenty I would be like thirty. And then you would say yes to 30, I'd be like... 40. 35. <laughs> so, you know, and that's the, if you go too slow, then he'll just stop at a number that he, you're not sure of. But if you go high, you'll, he's a fucking rat in a rat trap. He's gonna fucking give us <laughs> it, It's like one of those, like, psychology tricks. It's like where you say, in, like... It's like... I saw it on a YouTube video. It's like you ask someone for 100 bucks that's, like, your friend, and you, they go, like, no, I'll give you 20. 30. Like, <laughs> So he brings it down to a reasonable number because, like, what they think is, like, oh, my God, this guy wants a lot of money. Let me put it at, like, a lower amount. So, like, All right. how, what, how low of a calories are you trying to eat? Dude, I'm literally trying to stay under 1,000 calories a day. And that's okay, so easy. Unhealthy. Under five, uh, 77 easy dinners, under 500 calories. No, because I'm telling you, bro, that protein shake is going to only ma- is, is going to make way for about... 400 calories for dinner and if i have to i'll just eat a tv dinner every night and it, it would work it, i haven't that sounds kind of annoying it does. I, I i i you guys don't understand how bad i want this i i've made it my 100 percent goal and then when i get back to school i'm gonna ask that bitch again i want to see if her answer changed i want to see if she just said no because i was fat what's well, gonna take longer because it doesn't take three months. It'll take Dude, like four three months, months. Three months. Three months. When I time. first started going to the gym and I showed up sophomore year, I slimmed down so much. I'm feeling like this this period I'll grow more. I'll be understanding about what I have to do to lose more weight. Because I started the summer at 180. I dropped down to 170. Nice. No, I dropped down to 163 at one point. Even though? I was at 163 for one point. Now I'm at 170. I started at 180. How the fuck do you have bigger boobs than me at that point? Because I'm short. Uh, well, no, you're like, you're wider. You're wider, so like your skin stretches more. Since I'm taller and more lengthier, mine just kind of overlap. You just call me big. Yeah, I call big. No, he called you wide. I called you work. wide. <laughs> no, because like, you guys were making fun of mine. But I'm it's sorry. like, I'm sorry. you guys don't understand, like, I'm, like, my body type is, sm- like, more compact than all of your guys'. Is. Reminds, if that it's, makes sense. Like no, no disrespect, no disrespect. Bro, my tits are kind of nice, though. But, Same. like, but my, mine... <laughs> well, mine's are, like, all hard. Mine come <laughs> Don't fucking say that again. Oh, like, listen, like, touch it. It's literally all just muscle right here. Look for, like, a what? bit of fat. Mine, mine come out like this because my skin is stretching this way. It's coming out this way because I've been eating more, so it's trying to make me wider. But now that I'm not gonna allow that, I can fix it hopefully. Mm-hmm. And I was planning on just cutting out a whole bunch of people to hurt me, so I could get a gym pump and then just be like, "Hey guys, where were you guys all summer?" And just you. Have a six pack, and be like. What happened to you guys? Where were you guys? I'll come work with me and my dad. 
We go work in construction. In I, the hot, hot sun. I would need a ride. I got you. It's a long drive. It's a very long drive to work. How get, much would I get paid? A hundred dollars a day. A day? Twelve hours a day. Twelve hours a day? Day. Fuck no, dude. Oh my god, how much is that? A hundred divided by twelve. That, that's lower than minimum wage. But, 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 but. We can still bargain for it. Because, see, we're younger than everyone there. We're probably going to be the youngest people there. If we get hurt, we have to pay for medical bills. Because we won't be getting insurance. So we can just raise the price up a little by $20, $30. I'll have to talk to my parents about it. I don't know if they would want me going into construction. And I'd have to tell them where I was working. If you want to, just call me up. I start work next week. I'll, I'll ask them tomorrow about it because I did tell them I was looking for a summer job and it would burn a lot of calories. It would burn a lot of calories, trust me. And I plan on working out after school, uh, after that too. That's, no, that's exactly what I was thinking too. That would be smart. I could go there. Uh, what time would we start at? Six o'clock in the morning or earlier. That's okay. Because that means like... And that is get, very early. And then we would get back around three, four, sometime, if... Sometime in the afternoon. Yes. Like, but sometimes we'll come home around 10. Occasionally? Occasionally. That's like once a week, maybe. I, we don't know the schedule. I would they be, just give us a random schedule. This, this is going to sound bad. You might want to cut this out of the video. Okay. No. Yeah, then I'm not going to say it. Okay, <laughs> don't, don't say it. I'm not going to say it. Text it to me. Give me my phone. <laughs> Does it, Cody, where's this Actually, list? would it be racist to say this? Say it. How racist would you say this was? Just, Am I gonna be like the only white dude I give there? You, I um, uh, yeah, actually, probably. <laughs> I, like, I don't mean that in a bad way. I'm just thinking, like, I've like. This There's a lot of Mexicans bad. there. This sounds bad. Okay, I mean, okay. But I drove back past so many construction sites, and I've seen like two, maybe again, three white dudes. I wouldn't say it's really construction. It's more cement work. And besides, we wouldn't be doing anything dangerous. Oh, yeah. We, we would we, just be... He, he wouldn't want us getting hurt, so he'd be like, hey, go, like... We were with... just doing, like, the small stuff. Refill waters, get the coolers, bring them the tools, maybe even, like, even the thing out a little. That's the most we'll do. For a hundred bucks? For a hundred bucks a day. Maybe even more if we can bargain with him. It's not bad at all. If, if you're willing to get, pick me up every single day, yeah. like, it would have to be every single morning... Well, I plan on working three days a week. Okay, well, as long as those three days a week you can pick me up, I can probably do it. Because uh -huh. I can tell my mom, I'll be like, it's, I would have to explain to her the way that you explained it to me. I'd be like, it's construction, but not really. So we wouldn't be doing anything dangerous. We'd kind of be like the water boys on the construction team. And if you, well, we could get heat struck. That is true. But we'll have uh, wet bandanas to help us cool down. And don't drink, I know it's like very, like hard to not drink water when you're outside, but if you drink a lot, you'll still get like really bad heat stroke. So try to drink a little bit of water once in a while. It would just have to, it, it, I would have to talk to my parents about it. I would be, per, I'm personally okay with it. Like yeah. I would do it. Like you need jeans, boots. We'll, I'll provide you a shirt. <laughs> the Beaner exclusives. I'm Mexican, I can say that. <laughs> and a light colored vest. Light colored vest. Okay, I would. So basically, construction work. I would have to find boots. I could actually probably <laughs> borrow a pair of my brother's because he has four. Oh, and bring earphones or headphones. I'm gonna need them. Yes, yes, you are. Okay, but like, so like, would I have to go out and buy all that stuff? Uh, just the jeans and boots. Okay, I have jeans. We have a shirt that's uh, light colored. Uh, what would it be? Would it have to be a specific color of jeans, or uh, can it be like denim and then like light? Preferably a light color. Okay. Because again, if we have light colors, the sun will bounce off of it. And I I, I have two light colored jeans, and if we're working three days a week, I could just wash one. Yeah, I'll ask my dad if you if he can. It shouldn't be that, that too hard. It shouldn't be, and like, plus, it would, I would be sweating most of the time. It would be burning calories. Exactly. And plus, I just feel like my parents would be happy that I'm getting off my lazy ass, to be honest. Yeah, sure. See? I need it's to a win win for everyone. 
Because, dude, I'm, I'm genuinely looking for a job this summer, and literally, I don't want to work at Kroger or Sonic. <laughs> I know. God, I do not I would hate to work at a Kroger, bro. I do not oh. want to deal with people at Kroger. God, fuck. I hate working with people. Are those, like, those really old people that be like, well, I wanted this coupon, or this uh, This yes, is not for dude, sale, or something like that? my grandmother's one of those people, and I feel <laughs> bad saying that because I love her to death. She bought me the Crocs. Of course. But... God, she 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 would bring a handful of coupons, bro. I don't know. Okay, you guys know the store Coles, right? Yeah, yeah. Good store, dude. Yeah. We went there and we spent like eight hundred dollars. What the fuck? We spent at Coles? At like buying clothes, buying jeans, because Coles, dude. I don't know if you've been to Coles. It is expensive, dude. You know Nike sweatpants, sixty bucks. Why do you want your foot in the video, dude? I'm sorry, I'm stretching my foot. Like, you know, like, Kohl's, like, the Nike sweatpants are 60 bucks at Kohl's. Yeah. They're yeah. 60 bucks everywhere. Hoodies at Kohl's, around 60 bucks if you're not looking in the clearance section. You, you want a flannel, they're, like, 40. You want you want je good jeans, like Levi's, you need about 80 bucks for those. I have an amazing tip for this. Just go to the, what was it called? Not the pawn shop. Thrift store? Thrift store. They have everything there. The, the, okay, so, we get up to the front, and we also bought, like, two pairs of shoes, yeah. All that stuff, right? It was for it was for back to school shopping. Obviously, we're gonna spend a lot, of course. right? She had this Kohl's card, and this Kohl's card had like a whole bunch of Kohl's cash on. She swiped the card; it paid for all of it. I do not know how much Kohl's cash this woman has, but holy shit, it was the most pimp thing I've seen my grandmother do in her entire life. <laughs> Boom, brother. She, she was like. She was, I was like, Grandma, it's eight hundred and sixty-three dollars. You need me to put back anything? I was like, I can put back one of the pairs of shoes and a couple of the sweatpants. I don't need them. And she was like, No, I got it. I got this. <laughs> and then I was this, like, Approved. Have a good day. This and lady. I was like, I was really like, said, I got this. She. She said, Watch and learn. Yeah, Watch I, learn, boy. I, I stood there. I was just like, I went to. I, I didn't know how to react. I don't know how often she shops at Kohl's. She she doesn't she doesn't even have a lot of clothes. I don't know who she's buying clothes for. What the fuck is she doing around in the fucking city crip walking? <laughs> <laughs> she she just like leaves the house. She wears all blue. She's like, like my grandson. All right, fuck this shit. <laughs> yeah, for real. Fucking with the backwards cap. That would be amazing. Okay, the, the, so uh, my point. Uh, so what days would we work if we did the construction? Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I would not like three days in a row like that. I'd be cool with it. I could. I, I would be cool with it too. I can manage that because even for those Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, realistically, if I have a job, I don't really need to go to the gym, which I can still work out, do cardio and stuff. Yeah, that's what I said. But then I could do, I could do Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday gym. But, but I gotta take a snap. And Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, are all for the for your work. But are my parents gonna say yes? <laughs> We're just not copyrighted yeah, because of you. It was a second clip. It's fine. How dare you? Jack Harlow's going to take all our money. Hopping up. Da, da. Can't fucking take pictures. It's white boy summer, bro. Fuck you. Could I get him a shot? Could I? No. Could I? No. Okay. But I still guess. How long does it take you to take a fucking picture? <laughs> fucking ugly bitch, bro. <laughs> I gotta look pretty. Gotta look pretty. Gotta get the angles right. Yeah, but no, but we don't want to work Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah, I got I got a shit ton of headphones, too. I got Galaxy Buds. I got AirPods. I got... I swear something that you wouldn't mind fucking up later. Okay, just in so case if it drops and anything. Or if, just in case it starts raining or something. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, so I bring my Galaxy Buds. They're also bright yellow, so it go with the outfit. Yeah. Always got to care about your fit, okay? <laughs> so, what What are, like, what are we going to do for a great wolf? I kind of want to talk about that a little bit on the podcast. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, well, we plan on going in uh, June, right? Uh, July. July, sorry. That's bad. perfect, because guess what? If I help him do construction, and I'm getting $100 a day for three days in a month. I don't know if, we're get, if we get paid monthly or daily. That's the only thing. We um, could get paid monthly or daily or weekly even. Or even bi-weekly, which is every two weeks. Which is even worse. 
I hate bi-weekly. My parents get paid bi-weekly. It's horrible. Same. One week we live lavish, and then the next week we are the room. We are so poor. Exactly. My mom will be like, I have five dollars in my bank account, Joe. No, you cannot buy Madden. <laughs> Imagine being broke. And then I know it's not five dollars. She's just saying that because so I don't buy Madden points. She doesn't want to encourage. Can we can we talk about that? I I hate EA Sports, bro. Uh, I hate EA Sports. So I love the games, okay? Even though it's just a copy and paste of the same game over and over again, I just hate the fact that it's virtually impossible to build a team without spending money. It is like I I did one year with no money spent. The highest I got was a ninety one. Right now I've spent a good clean a hundred dollars, and I have I have like a ninety seven overall god team. Yes. Like it's like. It's like, why do I have to spend over a hundred bucks to play the video game? Makes me so sad. Why can't we have a better football game? Reyes, I'm gonna castrate you. <laughs> I don't spend money on games, I spend money on buying games. He spends money on the food he eats while playing games. I've spent two hundred dollars <laughs> buying games, and I'm not even joking. Hey, if we get movie king tomorrow, the movie trading goes right there, and you have extra money if you want to go buy another game. I do. I want to go buy Meta Gear Rising. It's an absolute amazing. Wait, game. isn't it the one where he's like a cyborg? Yes, it's absolutely. I have it, dude. The dialogue and voice acting in that game is absolutely hilarious. I have it. I'll just give it to you. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my I like god. how you didn't hear him the first time, and then he says it again. Are you serious? Yeah, here, okay, how about this? We make this deal right now. I will give it to you if you pay for my smoothie king. Deal. Oh shit, say less. Fuck you, you piece of shit. He just don't want to pay. Shit, I gotta pray. I have it. I now. wasn't thinking like that. If I don't have it, I'll go out and buy it specifically for you. Thank you. Because I, I, I'm i pretty sure I have it. It's twenty. It's twenty dollars on the market. I might have given it to my cousins. We're gonna go rob your cousins. Yeah, they for live real. in Gainesville. Your point being? That's like a 40 minute drive. They live in Gainesville? Yeah. Bro, we're literally like 10 minutes away from Gainesville. We're gonna rob them right Wait, now. Wait, give me my phone. I need to check my cousin's location on this <laughs> map. <laughs> Text your cousins. Make sure they have the game. If they, if they the have the game, it's gonna be scratched up and Wait, cut Wait, so if you work with Reyes, you'll have 300? It would be 300 a week. Hopefully. And then I would so, pitch in, Reyes would pitch in, and then we just need the other guys to pitch in a little bit. Yeah, and I'll still make more money. Because I still have my other job, too. I, I am very excited for this. We oh, shit. What? We are, like, that's my cousin up there. Told you. Yeah, I told you. We are not far from her. Yeah, I told you. Are y'all wanting to do a manhunt in Great Wolf? God. It would be fun, but I have a feeling we would get kicked out. I have an awesome feeling that we would also get kicked out. I, no, I think we'll just vlog a Great Wolf. I'm not too sure. See, that's the thing. Okay, what are we going to do about food? We would just bring our own food. Like, we'll bring a giant cooler with, like, a bunch of, like, uh, bring, chicken I, stuff. And I have plenty of coolers on my house. We need to one. bring stuff that we can only heat up with the microwave because they don't have stoves and all that in there. Ramen. No, I do not want to just live off of ramen. No, like, more, like... Not even like a big cup. But... I have a few things in mind. Alright, what's up? You remember like those fajita stuff you heat up in the fridge? Those are good, but at the yeah. exact same time, those were absolutely <coughs> bored for me. <coughs> oh my god, my back hurts to cough. What else could we cook in the microwave? Oh, um, uh. TV dinners! He's right. TV. For me. Okay. I, I would have specific high-protein ones for me, and if any of you guys touch it, I will figure out who touched it, <laughs> and I will shove an iron pole down your pee hole, bro. Ew. <laughs> I'll Van. take a 3DS stylus, Van's and like, I will shove it in there. Bro, Van would be like, are they all the same? And then you just death stare him. <laughs> Van, watch your ass tonight. <laughs> Quite literally. Ooh, bro, Van kind of... Big dog. <laughs> <laughs> you ever like walk up the stairs behind the dude and you're like, God damn! <laughs> no, actually, 
Bo Bear that's Van is dummy thick. Bo Bear has those bigger ass than half the chicks at her school. He's not wrong. He's <laughs> generally not wrong. Bro, it's just like I've I've seen it like when I'm walking up the stairs to go meet up with a Caitlin and Joshua during pitch. And it's just right here, <laughs> bro. I also do this thing where <gasps> Wait, we'll have money for the arcades and shit. Yeah, exactly. And Great Wolf. I'll do the I do the same. I one. remember. I remember. Okay, I'm sorry. I remember this one time. Me and Cody saw these little lightsaber things, and we we just stole them. We <laughs> did. Yes. In Great Wolf. Yes. I don't, I think my dad I don't remember, remember this. Like, yeah, no, because no one was around. They're just this. <gasps> yeah. I know what you're talking about and then now. We went to the room. We told your mom we bought it, and then we broke it like the next day. Oh my god, I remember that. Oh my god, we were horrible kids. I think I had like a blue one, you had a red one? I had a red one, you had a blue one. Hell yeah, bro. Absolutely horrible. Why did we do that? We were I'm gonna convince my parents first that I have a job opportunity at Hooters. And then I'll tell them that it's construction. <laughs> at Hooters? Yeah. <laughs> I'll be like, Dad? What are you gonna be at Hooters? Mad. I got titties. He's right. They wouldn't know. I would so. I have long hair. Guess I would what? so I give him my tip. I mean, give him a tip. Let's see, Let's see if he just shut his mouth and wear a mask and have makeup on. Bro, I he could pass, pass, off, I as pass off as a fat boy, bro. He really could, which is terrifying. But there is this. Uh, wait, I forgot. What, oh no! So I do this thing at school, where if I'm talking to like one of my friends or like a dude or a chick. And a dude bends over right next to me and his ass is in my face. I'll be talking and then I'll stop and I'll just go, <laughs> go back to talking to them. It happened in my chemistry class. Ernesto, Ernesto dropped his pencil and he went back over and picked it up. And it was right there. And I was talking to Gage and Gage was saying something and I just went. <laughs> <laughs> he started laughing. It was the funniest shit ever. I love doing that. Ernesto was cool with it. He kind of wanted me to do it more. <laughs> very, very, very scared. <laughs> do it again. Do it, said, do it again, but I'll get closer this time. I'll get closer. Back yeah. it up on you a little bit. Uh, yeah. All right, so, what else you want to talk about? I don't know. What do y'all want to talk about? I, I'm i actually pretty excited for the 4th of July party that we... Oh, the, co the cookout you want to do? I haven't, I haven't thought about that as much as the Great Wolf thing. Well, yeah, it's not that big of an event, but it's all of us together, can just you, eating can, out. Can you bring turkey patties? What the fuck did this guy just ask me? He said turkey patties. Are you serious? You literally just said turkey High patties. in protein, low in calories, good for you, good for the heart. Just eat meat, pussy. <laughs> Go back to your goddamn country. <laughs> <laughs> you can't put that in the video. <laughs> Go back to your country. <laughs> it was just, it was goddamn country. <laughs> oh. You can't put that in the video. I'll get canceled. But if by subscribers they can. Hey, fun fact. Did you know that uh, when it says, uh, when he says like this person might uh, who you might know on Instagram, yeah, that means that they were stalking your page. Are you serious? Yeah, it means I've it, had like a hundred of them. It means that bro, I've had it means so that many they of them. Looked at your page, scrolled through it, and then decided not to follow you and left. And then it gives you a notification saying, "Hey, this person." It doesn't tell you, "Hey, this person visited your page." It says, "Hey, you might know this person. You should follow them." That's creepy. That is very creepy. Why did you tell me this at the middle of the night? I'm gonna pay attention to that more often. I am too. I'm scared. I was like, bitch. See, Callie Rhodes, who you might know, is on Instagram. My mean page, one, two, three. Bro, five. wait. That's how I found your uh, Joseph. You remember that backup account I. It's not told? my backup account. It's some random. Uh, it's Guadalupe. Yeah. Guadalupe. He, he looked. I got a notification about that saying, hey, you might know this guy. And I was like, what the fuck? And so I guess Guadalupe stalked my Instagram page. This is terrifying. I hate this. I'm looking at who it's telling me. Yeah. Look, if you notice, everyone that does it is not from, like, our school. That's weird. I'm scared. 
All right, the podcast is about at 40 minutes, so I think we'll end it around here. Who the fuck is Nelly Van? Do y'all want... Oh, that's Van Neal. Who the fuck is Van Neal? He goes to y'all school. He's the the German man. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm not going to say this on video, but... Oh, God. Oh, my God, I know this shit. Okay. She was my old friend in middle school. I hated her. I hated her so much. Wow, that's that's fun. Y'all have anything to say before we end the podcast video? Uh, remember, smoke grass, eat ass, and live life to the fullest. Joseph? Leave on the positive note. Uh, I can't fart. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but wait for it. Oh, wait, show me the picture, show me the picture. <laughs> bro, why are we laughing at gnomes, bro? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that looks like your haters. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> 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 Bro, you tell me you look like that. <laughs>